Hey guys, I'm Tom Court, British hydrofoiler and professional kite surfer, and I'm here in Burnham on Crouch to meet Keith Musto, founder of this brand, and where better to meet him than surrounded by boats here in the harbour. Uh, I can see a 64 jumper. This must be him. Keith, lovely to meet you. Hello, Tom. I knew it was you because you've got your name on a shirt. <laughs> I need it these days. Well, I've got so many questions to ask you. Well, why don't we go and have a cup of coffee and we can sit and chat. The sun is shining, nothing could be better. Perfect gilet weather. <laughs> Let's go. Thank you. There we go. Thank you very much. Ah, thank you for having me. What was the original reason that you started Musto in the first place? I didn't like getting cold and wet, it was a simple reason. And I felt that better designs could be created. I couldn't uh, encourage existing manufacturers to follow that thinking. So uh, the only way to achieve it was to do it yourself. We had no money. It was really a matter of objective ambition, but no collateral. But having no collateral is no different from um, I want to win an Olympic gold. I don't know how, but I will get there somehow. So what is it that you love personally about being out on the water? Competition. That was the competition? Yes. All along? I like sailing. But if you put someone alongside me that I can challenge, then um, that's what I enjoy. So tell me a little bit about Musto's link and association with the royal family. Well, we've been fortunate enough to have had a very good relationship with the royal family for a long time. The result is being granted to royal warrants. It's a great honour to receive them. So you must be very proud of your silver medal in the Olympics. Yes and no. By today's standards, with the British team winning so many gold medals, uh, as well as silver and bronze, it's a fairly minor success. Well, I guess one thing you can say is that all the guys winning gold nowadays are all wearing mustard. Well, that's, that's nice to see, yes. Uh, I'll give you that one. Yeah. <laughs> What next? It feels like the wind's picking up a tiny bit and uh, maybe it's going to get good for kite surfing. How about, how about a lesson? Uh, I'll watch you if you don't mind. I've um, seen the videos and I'm still thinking about it. Well, let me know if I can tempt you out of the future. Thank you very much, Tom. It's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs>